How you doing? My name is Blackie and we're here in County Clare today. It's my home county, my favourite county. Um, today we're going to go on a journey. We're going to check out some of the, the cool kind of gems of the county, real hotspots to check out. Anytime I drive up around this area, I'm always in awe of the beauty of the place. It is stunning like, to have this on your doorstep. But if you come to County Clare, this is, you, you have to check this out because it, it is, it's something special, you know. Right, we're here in Doolin, County Clare. And this is a small fishing village right on the west coast. The Atlantic Ocean is just over there. And this is a special town because it's a home of Irish music. We're going to go into a pub here now called Gus O'Connor's Pub. World famous pub. I'm going to meet a good friend of mine inside here called Patsy O'Grady. He has a few stories for us to check out. I think this pub was, was built around 1832. And I suppose you could say there's been music here seven nights a week <laughs> since then. It became a kind of a, kind of a special home for Irish musicians worldwide. Patsy O'Grady here, he's, he's keeping the other tradition going, which is, which is the, the music in the house, which is, which is also special as well. Your house especially is a great house for music, and I think you still carry on that tradition of having people over um, during the day or in, in the evening time for music. Well, there's a lovely atmosphere in it, you know. We've become, I suppose, very independent in Ireland now in ways, and people feel that they don't need one another. But in this, you feel everyone is your friend. They start with a couple of musicians gathering together in the house and then uh, some of the neighbours would, would hear the music, they'd arrive in and everyone ends up doing their party piece. Well, we're standing here now in the Burn, which is the, the national park here in, in, in County Clare. It's a limestone kind of landscape that covers about 200 square kilometres. It's a special place. It's unique to this county. It really is an ancient landscape. We're going to carry on now and check out one of the most ancient sites in Ireland, and, but it's, it's based here in the Burn, and it's a place called Paul le Brown. Pretty stunning to look at it, you know? And underneath here is, is a huge burial chamber down beneath these rocks. They excavated, they found a lot of stone axes and polished rocks and things like that, which would have been kind of sacred things for the lads at the time, you know. They were all buried in there with them, obviously to send them on their way to the next life. OK, we've seen Paul Nebron, the dolmen here in County Clare, so we're going to continue up the road. I have a few more things to show you, so we'll go and check them out. I brought you here now to Ennis Diamond. If you can look out here, this is the Cascades, which is pretty spectacular. Ennis Diamond is a kind of a particularly beautiful, unspoiled kind of town, you know. It has a lot of traditional shop fronts that haven't been changed in, in, in years. It's a nice little market town as well. Right, we're here outside Eugene's pub, and this is one of the special little pubs here in, in, in Ennis Diamond. It's a lovely pub. It's uh, well known around this county. Great place to to meet people and to have a pint and a bit of crack. You meet a lot of characters here inside in this pub. When Father Ted was being filmed up the road, all the cast and crew would be hanging out here. There's a Father Ted corner over there. But um, yeah, it's worth coming in, having a pint and checking out the crack. Right, we're here in La Hinch. This is the last place I'm bringing you in this journey. La Hinch is totally in contrast to the rest of the places like in the Burn. This is a lively town. You can see behind me, there's a mile long beach. Plenty of surfers. It's probably the surfing capital of Ireland. It's a good place to hang out, and uh, that's what I'm going to do. You can check it out when you come here. You can go surfing, and uh, hopefully I'll see you here soon.